The following table contains the first five terms of given pattern A. Generate pattern B according to this rule. For every term of pattern A, so they give us the terms of pattern A here, multiply the term by three and add one to get the corresponding term of pattern B. Then graph the pairs of corresponding terms. So every, for every term in pattern A, we want to multiply by three and add one. So if we multiply zero by three, we get zero, and you add one, you get one. You multiply one by three, you get three, and then you add one, you get four. Two times three is six, plus one is seven. Three times three is nine, plus one is 10. Remember, we're just multiplying by three and adding one. Four times three is 12, plus one is 13. So those are the corresponding terms for pattern B. And then they ask us to graph them. So let's try to graph these points. Let's try to graph these points. So when pattern A is zero, pattern B is one. When pattern A is zero, so this is pattern A equaling zero, that's our horizontal axis, the value of pattern A. Pattern B is the value of our vertical axis. Pattern B is one. When pattern A is one, pattern B is four. So it's one. Four. So when pattern A is one, pattern B is four. Pattern B is on the vertical axis. When pattern A is two, pattern B is seven. So two and seven. When pattern A is three, pattern B is 10. So three, 10. So three in the horizontal direction, that's our pattern A value, and our pattern B value is 10. And then finally, when pattern A is four, when pattern A is four, pattern B is 13. Pattern B is 13. Now let's just look at these patterns. We see pattern A is increasing by one each time, while pattern B is increasing by its, well pattern A starts at zero and increases by one, while pattern B starts at one and increases and increases by three, which makes complete sense. It makes sense it starts at one because all of these you multiply by three and add one. So you start at one, and then the fact that we're multiplying by three, that's what's leading to the distance between these points being three. So let's check our answer, make sure we got this, we got this right, and we did.